So I've been crazy busy harvesting, delivering, and planting all this hydroponic lettuce here. But I really want to share with you this video that I have. Um, I don't really have time for it, but I just, I'm really excited about this in case you can't tell. Hydroponic broccoli. I really cannot believe the quality of this stuff. So this is really just an experiment. And you see the heads are just now forming. So these, so this system here, it was really just kind of like a, a piecemeal system. I didn't really have time to build it. Didn't have time to take care of it. Didn't have time to put a lid on my reservoir. Got some algae growing in there. I don't really care. I just wanted to prove this concept. If I could grow this stuff hydroponically and I can, but it was so easy. It was way easier than I ever thought it could be. So I never checked the nutrients in this solution. I just harvested some from my NFT system in there. Um, I slapped this thing together from like pieces and parts that I had laying around. It took me about an hour. This is an NFT system with uh, four inch PVC pipes and three inch net cups. I didn't have time to do a whole lot. I didn't have time. I don't even, like I said, I don't even have time for this video. I'm so busy, um, especially on uh, Fridays, like right now that I'm getting ready for the har farmer's market, but I'm also delivering to grocery stores and doing everything. I'm like the planter, the harvester, the delivery guy, the accountant, I'm all of it. But um, my wife sells at the farmer's market, so that's helpful. Anyway, um, look how small these plants are though. These, these plants are really, really small, so I wasn't really sure that it was gonna work out. Um, I had these growing in a nursery um, right after I sowed them. And then I took them from the nursery after they were in the nursery for about three or four weeks that I put them in here. These guys are growing in three inch net cups and I don't know really why, but I put the hydroton in there. Um, try to give it to some more support, but as you can tell, these guys don't really have a whole lot of support. I'm not crazy about this. I like growing these in pods better, but I'm going to continue to do this just because I think that the consistency of them, like most of these are ready to go right now. Not had any problems with, with anything in this system. I had thrips, I had some thrip damage early on, but that was about it. I'm so excited about this. Broccoli is not a profitable crop, but I just love growing it. So let's do a walkthrough of the system. So in here, I have a 600 and 20 gallon per hour pump that feeds to this three quarter inch PVC pipe. I've got a valve right there. Um, I got this going on full throttle. Then I have these uh, three eighths top hat grommets that have a quarter inch line coming out of it. it goes to there. I use some plumbing strap with, with some screws. These screws are sheet metal screws. Kind of hold it in place. So I got that horse shoot around. I used the heat gun to close off this end so it wouldn't leak. And then I just have a table basically. All the stuff was already prefabricated. I just had to put it together. Like I said, this was just basically an experiment. I'm going to modify the system. I'm going to put end caps on, on it, on these uh, four inch PVC pipes. I'm going to level it. And then, so that will put a little bit of standing water in there because the net cups don't really reach the bottom of the, of this system. And, um, so I'm going to cap this and I'm going to put a, uh, like a, like a two inch, um, I don't know what you call it, like a, like a four to two inch coupler. And then that'll have some, that'll have some residual water in there. And then I'm going to make a downspout into the, into the reservoir. And I'm going to put two more woo, right there and right there, two more uh, pipes on here because you can just see these, these plants are really compact. These sucker, these are gypsies. The leaves are really, really tiny. See, usually these are like the size of your head, but these are small. So these, these this is, Gypsy is perfect for hydroponic um, broccoli. Anyway, I might do a build on the next, um, when I actually go to, to uh, redo this system, um, but totally worth it. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna try growing cabbage next. Um, I already grow cabbage in my NFT system, been very successful in that. But uh, I think that my customers would really love if I started providing some of these um, larger staples that nobody really wants to uh, nobody wants to grow because it takes so much time um, these things have been in here since April 23rd it is now I think June 15th um, so these have been in here for I don't know I guess a little bit less than eight weeks not too bad they were in the nursery for three or four weeks um, and then it took one or two weeks to get them into the nursery so I hope this is helpful um, 
Oh, it's way easier than I thought it would be. Thanks for watching.